people, God's people. Uh, because I would like, what if I, what if, what if my mom would have parented? But I was adopted. I was given up here in this city in 1990. And uh, I've been in Milwaukee. I've been in Milwaukee. I did two years in Tennessee in college. Uh, and I, I had to come to this show. I had to. I, I missed all the buses. I was about to leave out the Greyhound. The lady said, where are you going? I said, that's nowhere now. Because <laughs> all the tickets are stuck. She said, where do you want to go? I said, Milwaukee. Uh, I mean, dang, I said Chicago. And she said, it's a coach bus right there. And so I ended up making a way. So I thank y'all. But bro, I don't want you to have to hold the phone. So can you please just set it somewhere that we can capture a moment. Um, uh, let's see. How long I got? Five minutes. Five. But you came from Milwaukee. You, we give him ten. We give him ten. Yeah. Ooh, don't yeah. do it to me. My birthday at the end of the month. Hey. All right. Yeah. All right. Yeah. 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 Don't worry about it. Yes, sir. Hey, all the black men in the building. Can we make some noise? Hey. Black men, where y'all at? Yeah. <laughs> Chicago, where y'all at? Yeah. Learn of me by discussion, not worried about repercussion. So jealous you start cursing at me. Not one encounter me, yet you will say that I'm lucky. And on top of that, they tell you that I'm a puppet, but nah, that's me. You see, words are like a sword trying to cut through my existence with slander that's outlandish. I breathe. One half of me says F you, the other half comes in peace. Yet with each move I make, they find a way to take it from me. Have you ever felt so much hate when your emotions start to quake and your hands start to shake, have you ever contemplated missing the date? If you have, I can't relate, but it's like the sweetest piece of a cake because you know it's all for a reason, but at least you hey. made. Through email, texts, PO boxes, and statuses for a second, they show love and they seem like they're not mad at you. They smile and show gratitude. But what would you do if you woke up at eight and all you felt was hate? They say silence kills more than guns, so go ahead and have your fun. Meanwhile, I'm dying inside, but at least you're not the one to be misjudged, misguided, misunderstood, yet remain quiet. Because my reign has just begun, and I know you know why. It's because I'm absolutely absolute, so just salute when I die. Wow. Tell heaven that I'm coming home and leave the key under the mat. Except the haters as they come along, and we would just have to be okay with that. They say for one to win and one must lose, but why would I allow you to choose when I know there's just two of us? So as we tango, let's untango and let's set the record straight. You got haters, I got haters too. It's such a senseless debate. But what keeps me awake is not how much hate I can intake and whether it be some money spent or where I've been, I know you can't relate. So haters, I hear you, I hear you, I hear you, I hear you, but don't listen. And that's the reason you feel like I'm fake, but I remain real. Through hate. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. It's like a container trying to contain us, telling us our true aspirations will only make us famous. And we're not merely paying enough attention to realize we're already famous. You see, that's the reason that they've aimed at us and they've realized we've forgotten our names and got caught up on entertainment and can't tell that all that hurt that we're producing is coming from pain. We sick and tired of struggling. It seems it's like we're traveling for nothing, but we don't complain because we see change. You see, MJ had game and even Max Payne in the Bible, even Jesus had a drink, but Luther King had a drink. So what's yours? Have you forgotten who you are? I mean, how do you forget what the sky looks like when you're a star? Remember when we graduated with our friends? What about us on our senior picture cards? It was those characteristics that made us who we are. But it's like a container, trying to contain us. And the more you squeeze, the more I can't breathe. And the more you try to make me stay, the more I want to leave. It's like, don't do this and don't do that. And don't say this and don't say that. And you could blame the liquor, the weed, the club, or the crack, but the fact is, curiosity killed that cat. Ah. In fact, <laughs> have you unloosed the top of the container instead of applying more pressure to contain us? Then when critical situations evolve, we'll be more adequate to resolve instead of standing there looking brainless because you contained us in this container.
Manipulators come around us like propellers, professing to propel us forward, and yes, I too have been convicted of being too smart and too happy of a free man. No quarterback, though, I'm more like free man than that good. By receiving good graces, handshakes, and favors throughout nations, it seems it's like wherever I land, I find more reasons to live than to die. And although life may seem hard now, that's why for the future, I try. Sometimes I lie to escape the truth, an example of self-sacrifice, but with me knowing people who go through some of the same things that some people couldn't imagine, let alone view, uh, who would have knew stories of a crumbling world were true. I sought out a few places where I could unpack my suitcases, but who waits for the truth as the truth waits like waitresses waiting for tips that come from food plates. I still haven't found ways to deal with rejection, but we know that. But do we know from who? They say the light came on in the beginning, and since the beginning, it's been on every since from being falsely prosecuted, convicted of my innocence, all for a few dollars and a couple of cents, all for some lousy couple to make the rent. Then I too would flinch like a finch, sitting on a fence next to a house that belonged to a hardworking man that was left by a woman when her own sense stopped making sense. I just hope that this is making sense. As she explains to me her needs, money, 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 an old song on repeats, I ask myself, have thou come if this fall for defeats? A battle you can see by the feet, sleep that gets none by sheets, and a cold night when it's breeze from a broken window makes it easy for demons to creep. Now, could it be the consequences of the streets? A lesson to a teacher that now has the one to teach, or is it that the guys that came into her life and her consideration of men were only there to leech? Whoa. This concept left abbreviations of love and explanation always kept so brief. It seems just like she needs medicine for her heart because as it continues to beat, every blessing in the form of a previous speech gets blocked, like the beat. She needs to be complete. Her heart says yes, her mind says it doesn't know, and her soul is still on repeat. Her needs.